Hi everyone, it's PJ and Lulu Productions, and it's been a long time since I made a video, so um, I just wanted to give you an update on some things. Um, there is a new doll since I last made a video. This is um, MAG number 40, and I did an opening video of her, which I didn't put on YouTube because it didn't turn out that great. So. Um, this is her. I think she is so pretty. I bought her and I absolutely loved her and then I thought, well, do I want to keep her? Do I not want to keep her? And I'm glad that I kept her because I think she's beautiful. And she's in Ivy's New Year's dress, I think. Um, very pretty. I really like this. So I'm really happy with her. She's so pretty and I think... I am naming her Mei Ling or Marley. I'm not sure yet, but um still trying to think of a name for her. And behind her is, I don't know where I'm going to go with all these. Um, this is Nellie, also known in my collection as Harper. And she is wearing the riding outfit. Looks very cute on her. Um, I really like it, especially with her shorter hair. I don't know, for me I like shorter hair dolls. Um, but she looks so cute. I love her blue eyes and her freckles. She's very pretty and her short um, strawberry red hair. And here we have McKenna. And this is the um, doll my daughter got for Christmas from Santa. And you probably saw a video of it on my YouTube page. And I love McKenna's hair. I think it's uh, beautiful. Um, <clears throat> She's wearing the Interstar University outfit here, and then she has, evidently she's been baking because she has her little apron on from the baking set. And then next we have Marie Grace. Oh, beautiful Marie Grace. She's so pretty. So pretty. And she's wearing, I think it's last year's Valentine's outfit. Um, anyway, she looks so cute. Little red strappy shoes. I have renamed her Rue just because I think that suits her more. And she is my modern girl and also serves more in Caroline's time period because I'm not planning on getting Caroline. So, um, she is probably going to be wearing a lot of her outfits too. And then I have, we'll go here. Um, this is um, MAG number 47, I think. And she's wearing the raincoat and boots outfit. Um, her name in our collection is Larkin. And when I say our, I mean my daughter's and mine. Um, this is Larkin. And she's so pretty. I love her. I love her straight hair. She's really pretty. I love her face mold and her skin tone and her eyes. And oh, beautiful. And then, this is M.A. Jean number 56, and this is Reagan. If you can hear my kids in the back, I'm very sorry, they're screaming. And she has this pretty, cute little freckles here, and she's wearing the roller skating outfit, which I think is totally awesome. Um, when I was growing up, this is um, from like the 80s, 90s totally cool outfit that could pass for that time period, um, even though it's more of a modern outfit. And I love her curly hair, short curly hair, it's so pretty. And then my Samantha, this is Primatel Pleasant Company Samantha from, I think back in 89 is when I got her, I'd have to look at Christmas pictures, but um, she is wearing an American Girl exclusive. And then red boots that I purchased off of eBay. And the city, is it city chic? Sunglasses, something like that. And then the last doll, let me just move this. My daughter got the bitty baby monitor for Valentine's Day. And this is Cecile. And she is best friends with Marie Grace. And I have renamed her Simone. And I absolutely think she's so so pretty. Um, she has the cute little tendrils, the hazel eyes, beautiful skin color, and I forget what outfit this is, but it's the current winter 
snow type of outfit with the adorable gray boots and the pink bow. Very light pink, very pretty pewter gray. Um, love that. So this is our collection so far. And I'm going to be probably going to Seattle in May. So I will hopefully be able to get to stop at the Seattle American Girl store and see what we can come up with. I don't know if we're going to be getting... Um, sage or another doll or just some um, other things like the bed with the trundle in it but right now we have one two three four five six seven eight dolls and they're so beautiful um, and then here as you can see here all of this this is in my daughter's room sometime this summer this summer probably this area will get transformed and I'm planning on um, making an American Girl dollhouse for her so I have to design it and um, construct it and figure out how to build it but I've look, been looking at some ideas on YouTube some of you have awesome dollhouses um, that your parents have made for you so I plan on making one or for your that you made yourself um, and I plan on making one for my daughter so Thanks for watching. Comment below. Um, and I will make another video soon. Bye.